Hello, everyone. In this election, for the first time in 30 years, the ANC will lose its majority, but they will do anything to stay in power. Imagine a coalition between the ANC, the violent EFF, and the Zuma faction. Under this coalition of corruption, life will only get worse. This election is about survival. Unite to rescue South Africa. Vote DA. The Democratic Alliance is receiving backlash over its election TV advert of South African flag bending ahead of the elections. The advert was initially released to get more people to vote for the official opposition, but was not received well by South Africans on social media. They stated that, that banning the flag was disrespectful and sending a wrong message. In the advert, a South African flag is banned to ashes, with a background voice narrating how the DA will save the country from the fire. The voice continues to bash the African National Congress, the violent economic freedom fighters and the Jacob Zuma faction, saying under this coalition of corruption, life will only get worse. According to the DA, the advert showed how the country was slowly being destroyed while people were watching. Launching the advert over the weekend, the DA leader John Stenazen said the banning of the flag can be stopped only if his party was to put power. He said we can stop our flag from banning entirely and reweave its threats to represent the consolidated dream of a united and prosperous country that we all share. But South Africans were not buying into that, taking it to the X app to express their grievances. The former public protector Tulima Donzela commented and said, The banning of our flag is ill-advised, seems to show disrespect and disloyalty to the flag, which to many of us is more than a flag but a symbol of triumph against apartheid. In some countries, it's even a crime to ban the flag. Another one commented and said, this just doesn't sit right with me. So DA top leadership actually thought, hey, let's ban the SA flag for our TV ad. Someone also said two issues. One, banning a national symbol of unity. The public outrage is fully justified. A bold but false claim that for the first time, the ANC will lose its majority. It is stated as a fact, but the election outcome is yet to be determined. If they had said opinion polls suggest that the ANC will lose its majority, it will be acceptable. Such lies discourage voters and fuel apathy. Another one tweeted, Of all politicians in South Africa, John Stenazen is the least intelligent of them all. He should go back to looking after dogs. That's his calling. However, some users commended the DA on their advert. One said, that's a good ad by the DA. If ANC and EFF and MK govern this country, we'll be on fire. That's not what we deserve. We deserve clean, good, pro-market governance. Well done at our DA at Johnston Hazen and Helen Zill. Another one said, I'm not a fan of the DA, but it's actually quite clever. The unbanning of South Africa Obviously, a lot of people took offense within the first few seconds and took straight to social media. What's your take on this one, people? Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more news.